Life City family, what is up? It is Art and I coming at you from Sam's Club here in Evanston, Illinois. We're about to do our second ever Sam's Club haul because I keep getting messages from you guys, DMs and email showing new things at Sam's and a few of them are not even at Costco. They're Sam's exclusive. So I thought it was time to make another Sam's review to show the new, exciting and healthy items at Sam's Club. So let's go in there, show all the good, all the bad and why. Uh, before we get rocking and rolling, this video is also sponsored by Four Sigmatic. They have a new flavor of protein powder that's out that is fantastic with a promo code I'll get to in a few minutes. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, share. All those things are great, but also there's a bell icon below the video. Enable all notifications because we have like three of these kind of videos every week and three live stream cooking demos and making a recipe from start to finish. You don't want to miss out, y'all. Okay, let's go mask up and do some shopping at Sam's. Hello, hello, governor. Here it is. Keto Probiotic Snack Mix. I just got an email about this from one of you guys last week. Price is fantastic, but how are the ingredients? Because Costco has a Keto Snack Mix also that has a couple shoddy ingredients. Let's see about this guy here. So there's two flavors of the Keto Snack Mix. Let's look at the chocolate one here. Uh, almonds, sugar-free dark chocolate chips. How do they do that? With erythritol, with stevia, roasted hazelnuts, what kind of oil? That's like, oh, look at this, y'all. MCT oil from coconuts or palm. It's not palm oil. It's the medium chain triglycerides from palm and live and active cultures. And the other uh, flavor here is cheddar cheese, which uh, aged cheeses like cheddar have no lactose. It'd be better if it was organic, but that's unheard of in these snacks with other ingredients. Macros super duper clean that's low carb you guys wow this is actually better than that keto snack at costco because that one uses sunflower oil and doesn't have near the amount of ingredients in here and at 12.98 a price limited time only let's hope it sticks around if you're a uh, sam's club member and you want a real keto snack this is cool anytime you see a product at a store that could be great please dm me email me i love seeing gems like that that's awesome oh okay, paso check it out art Another great Bobby approved snack here at Sam's Club, I didn't see this last time, is Siete. Now at Costco, they have Siete also, but it's the plain chips. These are the squeeze of lime. And unlike other flavored chips on the market, how do they actually get the lime flavor in there? With lime oil. A little bit of citric acid for tartness, but avocado oil. These are always baked or fried in avocado oil and they're grain free, gluten free with coconut flour and cassava flour, not low carb they are paleo and gluten-free. They're a fantastic chip. It says once again, limited time only. I really hope it's not limited time. This is probably one of the best chips here. It's one of the best chips on the market. Look at the price here. It's 58 cents per ounce at any other grocery store. It's a dollar an ounce. So this is a great price for the, one of the best chips on the market. This is cool. Let's just hope it's not limited time because whoo, that's nice. Oh, check it out. This was not here last time we were here. Look at this art. They now have 100% grass-fed beef burger patties. Yep, see, 100% grass-fed and grass-finished. Ooh, they are a little lean. They're 93% beef, 7% fat. I believe the ones at Costco are 80-20. Look at the price art. Actually, that's way more expensive than Costco. It's 537 per pound. Uh, the ones at Costco are uh, actually 380 or 390. So this is not a bad deal. I'd actually go over to the fresh uh, beef section. They have 100% grass-fed beef for under $5 a pound. I'd rather make my own uh, burger patties out of that. And I also saw, Art and I did, they have 100% grass-fed filet mignons over there. Costco doesn't have that. So that was super cool to see. But if you need a preformed patty, there it is right there. Grass-fed uh, beef here at Sam's Club. In our previous Sam's video, we talked about avocado oil being a good deal and probably just as good of a deal as Costco. But now that we made that avocado oil scam video the other week, I would not buy the avocado oil at uh, Sam's Club because we always look where it comes from now. And this says product of USA, Mexico, which is good, but Spain. What's the problem with that? Well, I don't wanna spoil my avocado scam video from the other week, but Spanish olive oil is known to cheat. Avocado oil. Oh, thank you, avocado oil is known to cheat. Cheat with cutting it with canola oil, soybean oil, and rancid oil. You really wanna get Mexican avocado oil produced in the US. So I would put this down, because you really wanna buy something that's pure avocado oil, but pick this up. 
Speaking of olive oil, like I said before, this is pure 100% extra virgin California olive oil. And once again, Art, it says limited time only. I really hope it's not because $9.98 for 25 ounces is great because you want to know exactly where your olive oil comes from. We're going to make a video, I think, next week about why you really, really want to cook with single origin extra virgin olive oil. You don't want mystery oils or mystery olives from around the world like that avocado oil had three different regions. This is pure one source, California extra virgin. This would be a good cooking and or finishing olive oil. This is great, but those big jugs of olive oil like the one right down there, those are gonna be mystery, inferior quality olives you don't want. So scoop that and scoop the extra virgin coconut oil here. Unrefined virgin coconut oil. Hello, hello, look at that. Great price for 56 ounces, loaded with MCTs, loaded with healthy lauric acid and good saturated fats. Get that for good, but unfortunately stay away from the mystery olive oil. Let's take a quick break from the video and thank today's sponsor, Four Sigmatic. I've been using Four Sigmatic for a long time. They've been sponsoring the channel for a long time and they believe in superfood mushrooms and they put it in products that you and I have every day, like protein powder, like tea, like coffee. And these are real superfood mushrooms like reishi, lion's mane. No, none of the products taste like mushrooms, but you get all the health benefits from them. And right now they have 10% off just for Flav City fans and something really exciting is going on. This is their normal unflavored plant-based protein powder, which I love. I use almost every day. You can see on Instagram stories. This is their brand new plant-based protein powder with sweet vanilla flavor. Look on the back here. How do they get the vanilla flavor? Natural flavors, artificial flavors, cane sugar. Nope. They do it with real vanilla powder, real maple syrup powder. We've done loads of videos about protein powders. A lot of them are minefields. This is one of the best. I absolutely love it. And what's really cool is if you look at the uh, protein blend, you have pea, hemp, ch 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 chia, pumpkin, coconut, and seven superfood mushrooms and adaptogens in here too. And there's one really interesting thing on the label. It says third party tested. That's for pesticides and heavy metals. A lot of plant-based uh, plant protein powders won't do that. They do. This is as clean as they get. I love it. Just out on the market. Check it out. Use my link down below. Gets you 10% off. Um, I really love everything they make. And thank you guys for sponsoring the video. All right, here it is. We talked about this in the last Sam's Club video. It's the olive oil chips. It's not only the best chip here at uh, Sam's Club. It's probably one of the best potato chips on the market now because it's fried in olive oil, one of the best oils on the market, and there's no other cruddy ingredients. It's just potatoes, olive oil, and salt. Any other chip on the market will be fried in canola oil, safflower oil, soybean oil. Now, is it gonna be the best quality extra virgin olive oil? No, but it's still the best quality oil on the market. And my other favorite uh, chips that are fried in avocado oil from Kettle are being discontinued. I recently found out about that and I was devastated. But look at this, they're on sale, you guys. It's 24 ounces for $5. Sometimes I buy these for Desi at uh, Whole Foods in a small bag is about $3. This is a great deal. I'd scoop that all day. Best chip here at Sam's and probably on the market. And sometimes I see this, like check this out, Art. I see a chip like this and it really bothers me. You'll pick this up like organic red quinoa chips. You're like, oh wow, organic quinoa. Quinoa is good for you. But when you read the back of the label here, ingredients, first one, corn flour. Corn flour was not listed on the front and corn flour is a simple carby starch with no nutrition. It's fried in organic high oleic sunflower oil. While high oleic is a heart healthy or fatty acid profile, sunflower oil pales in comparison to olive oil. And look how high up the cane sugar is here. And then you get down to the uh, chia seeds and the quinoa. So very deceptive. That's why we always say, don't read the front of the label. Look at the ingredients. So I'd pass on that and get that big bag of Boulder olive oil chips, which I'm gonna get for Desi. The problem is neither Art or I are Sam's Club members. So we have to figure out how to check out. Maybe we'll borrow someone's membership. I don't know, but I'm not going home without those chips and the Siete chips also. Oh no. I've seen so many pictures from you guys that Sam's Club has Vital Farms pasture-raised eggs. They don't have them anywhere. All they have is organic Eglin's Best. Oh, if you have 
the Vital Farms pasture-raised eggs at your Sam's Club, get them. They're the best eggs you can get at a warehouse. Some Costco's have pasture-raised, but really only on the West Coast. I'm really bummed out they don't have them here because pasture-raised eggs have the best nutritional profile of any eggs, and they're free to forage. Even when you see an organic free range, it stays inside all the time, so I'm super bummed out I don't see it here. But if you have the Vital Farms at your Sam's Club, scoop that all day. Art seems to be over here. Dude, dude. What do we got? Whoa! We got Rao. Rao at Sam's Club? Can you think it? Wow, they didn't have this, but something looks weird. I'm used to seeing big bottles. Costco might be bigger than this. Like, this is 22 ounces. How big is the one at the Costco? 28 ounces, actually. Okay. So this comes out to a two pack, 22 ounce bottles, 20 and a half cents an ounce, which probably similar. To Costco. Oh, I, don't I think when you do the math, because Art used to be an accountant in a former life, that does sound about the same, even though it's smaller bottles. So, But still a bigger bottle than you find in most grocery stores. I think it's 18 in the grocery yeah, store. Yeah, for sure. So I'd so, scoop that for sure. This is the best yeah. pasta sauce at a Sam's Club because, Art, let me hand you that. Okay. If you look at the next best sauce here, which I believe would be the organic Sam's Club one, you'll notice a very big difference for the first ingredient. Always look at the first ingredient. Rayo's or Rao is made with whole peeled tomatoes. And the, usually the cheaper ones, yep, see, are always made with tomato puree. It's always going to be inferior tomatoes, but I will give them props because they're using extra virgin olive oil and no cruddy ingredients. I mean, come on, a three pack of 24 ounces for $5.34? Waldo. Still really good. Waldo? It's a really good deal. The price is ridiculous, huh? Wow. Wow, wow, wee, wow. That's cool. Wow. Good deals to be found on pasta sauce. Well said. All right, there's Waldo swarming, but anyway, not a bad second choice, but go with the Rayos. Waldo. Before we leave this uh, section, you might be saying, yeah, but Bobby, tomatoes are in the Dirty Dozen, and the Sam's Club is organic, and Rao's isn't. True, that's the only fault of this one, but these are peeled tomatoes, and a lot of the chemicals or pesticides are on the tomato peel, so while it'd be better if it was organic, it's still okay, it tastes better, and the ingredients are wetter. Always, Rao wins, boom. Wow, this is interesting, you guys. I haven't checked out the supplements aisle too much here at uh, Sam's Club, but this is really cool. So first I found peanut butter powder. This is actually one of the better ones on the market because usually they sneak cane sugar in these powders, which is a no-no, but these guys are putting paleo coconut sugar in there. It'd be great if it was organic peanuts, but that's not the biggest deal in the world. But we're only talking about two grams of coconut palm sugar for two tablespoons, not bad. And coconut sugar has a really, really nice flavor. So that's great. I'm not even sure they have that at Costco. But look what I just found here. These are keto bars by Kiss My Keto. So there's more and more keto stuff here. Let's check out the ingredients. This is chocolate cookie dough. Okay, cook coconut oil instead of palm oil, like a lot of uh, keto products are using here. Uh, let's see, MCTs, sweetened with stevia. Does have natural flavors, but a lot of them have it. I don't see any cruddy oils or anything. And the bottom one here, wow. Ah, uh, this one has peanut oil. That, that's a little bit of a bummer, but this one's not a bad one. See, the thing with keto is a lot of times they'll be using cruddy oils and other fillers. Uh, this one's not terrible. Uh, Hold on. Like, clear? Clear. Wow, we haven't had a Waldo scare in a long time. Uh, so not terrible, you can do better, but that peanut butter powder, that's really good stuff. No, folks, you are not seeing Double Art and I wearing the same exact shirt here. It's part of the new Flav City line coming soon. I'll let you all know when that comes out. We got some really fun uh, food pun t-shirts, but that's it. That's what's new, healthy, and exciting at Sam's Club. They do have some new items that are really, really cool. A couple that Costco don't have, but all in all, Costco is better. But if you live in Walmart country, you don't have access to it. So that's it. Check out Four Sigmatic using my link down below. Get the 10% off. Try that protein powder. It is best in class. If you want to see more hauls like Sam's Club, I want to get the Big Locks pretty soon. Uh, BJ's we don't have around here, but there is a Big Lots art like on the west side. We'll go there. Y'all let me know. Like, subscribe, share. It's the only way our channel keeps growing. But from Evanston, home of the first place Chicago Cubs, Art and I leave you like we always do. Hashtag keep on cooking. Mad love and peace. I don't know about you, but I'm taking the elevator out. See you guys.